here we are at Harry Lee's Rocklands. I'm going to say this wrong, aren't I? Here we are at Harry's Rockley's Bush Camp. This is not that far from Monato in South Australia, and it is beautiful. Uh, not that I'm here to tell you about the camping spot, because it is a cracker. Um, I'm actually here to talk to you about the new uh, Safari lighting system that we're going to show off in this video. So that's Safari, not like the snorkels, it's S-A-F-I-E-R-Y. And it's what we're starting to install around the place. This is it here. Um, we put them in, uh, well, I'm testing it on my camper trailer, but I have been using it in my um, YC2 Patrol for some time up here. Um, it's a cool little light. Uh, I'll give you some night shots. And what I'm digging about this light is it kind of looks factory. Uh, it's not like other things where you've got to drill and muck around and have like things hanging off the end here or it doesn't look like down lights in your house or anything like that it's a cool light it comes paired with an even more cool switch i'm going to take you through that so i'm going to show you like what all the lights look like ambient sort of lighting uh and then we'll go into it when it's dark and then i'm going to talk about how to wire this up because you don't wire this up the same as what you would any other sort of um switch i know this because we blew the first one up and it's not warranted so um I'll, I'll show you how all this negative switching works and all the dimmable functions and so forth it's super cool walking you through the functions of the switch press and hold and the little lighting around the switch light goes off press once the light comes on press and hold again and it's dimmable down to a minimum of 20 percent press and hold again and it goes back up to 100 percent and you can have your center light oh, i didn't show that there's a spot feature so that's the center light i'm pressing the center button this is the surrounding light that's both of them together if you want extra light and you can turn them off and have amber as well dimmable of course bit of a different application but we're using the safari light for around the camper trailer and about to cook up dinner i'll show you the light and a bit of my induction cooktop setup right, too. time to start cooking uh, we've got all the batteries and stuff in the front there's a three kilowatt inverter and 200 um, amp lithium dcs battery in here we'll start a bit of a cook up so uh we pick our watts so i'm going to put on 1500 watts i'll do high and start we're off and running nutritional meal tonight hot dogs <laughs> see that it started the mosquitoes are out time to turn this to amber i think I think it's dark enough now to show you the full effect of pretty much every light I've got turned on around the camp with um, pretty much all of it's the safari stuff. So we've got in the car, a bottle of red up here, a centre one so I can see into the with all the electrical into the hatch here. cooking and this table can go on either side so I've just decided to cook underneath the tent tonight. At the back this is actually going to be a dash off-road rock light but I'll put it up here as a test. These Trailmaster campers, pod campers come with a light on the inside already so that's on and then around this side as well to give kids some light to play. See, take their iPads away, give them some wood, and they still have fun. How about that, kids? Skateboarding. <laughs> Good job. All right, ready? Three, two, one, go. Oh, nice trick. Oh, you're balancing. <laughs> Parkour. All right, morning time. 
and I just pulled the switch out so you guys could have a, a closer look at it. So this is the switch. You can order these with um, what I've got written on here. This is the standard way of ordering it, um, which is the center light, amber, white, and then the auxiliary. So that's two amp, two amp, two amp dimmable, and auxiliary is eight amp non-dimmable. Non dimmable <laughs> it's hard to say now it's all negatively switched i'm not going to talk about whether that's a good or bad idea but this is how this switch works and the way you wire it so coming off your battery um, fused of course you go to the 12 volt in and earth then all your lights get powered by this 12 volt out so you run positive to all of the lights that you want to run and then on the negative of each one of these um, these are the three two amps and that's the eight amp so all earths go to here all positives from all the lights go to here don't earth it on the chassis or anything else like that and then power in and earth that's the way it works do it any other way and it goes zoop, and doesn't work and there's no warranty because um, you can pull them apart like if you return them you can pull apart and see that that's what happened there we go, that's the end of this little video and our stay at Rockley, Harry's um, campsite at Rockley. Nice little place actually, the most tranquil little view. Now this light, if you want one, you can get it from dashoffroad.com.au of course. And that's the end of the video. Thank you for watching, we're going to see you next time on YouTube. Yeah, yeah.